Hey, hey, y'all. Welcome to this week's grocery haul. Changing it up a little bit this week. My name is Tiffany. This is our small town life. I'm so glad that you're here to spend a little time with me today. I'm sitting outside of Walmart. We're going to go in and get a few groceries. I'm going to share that with you. Changing it up a little bit, though. One, I'm not doing pickup. We're going in the store. And I wasn't even going to come to Walmart. I was going to go to like a local grocery store, but there's something I need that I need to get at Walmart. So we went ahead and came here. And I just want to change it up a little bit. I just want to do something different. So instead of taking all the groceries in, laying them out on the table, showing them to you that way, I think what I'm going to do is as we put things in our bucky, I'm going to show you what we're getting. So we're going to take you in the store with us. Let you go grocery shopping with us. We'll see how that goes. And then once we get home, I'll go over the meal plan for the week. I've also had some people ask if I ever share about our budget or what we spend on groceries. And so I think we'll talk about that a little bit more after we get home too. So, all right, let's go get groceries. I'm going to do prune, apple. What else am I knocking off here? We'll go ahead and get one of those too. A pear, pineapple. And then he likes the pumpkin. Some peas. Wyatt just woke up from his nap. Banana. What is this one? Banana, blackberry, blueberry. And I'm going to go ahead and get one more thing of peas. Fletcher's been liking these yogurt bites. You want to try some of those? No. Sure, we can do that. What are those? <laughs> Pumpkin, apple, and cinnamon. Okay. What do you think about them, buddy? Are they good? They're good. They're good. Hello Bello has Grinch diapers. Those are cute. Not quite ready for that yet, though. I'm gonna put it on the bottom. I need to get some more cat food. Ooh, it's a big heavy one. There we go. I'm gonna go ahead and just get a pack of these. And then Easton's going around to get some wipes. Thank you, sir. It shocked me. I'm gonna get some Fairlife milk for Justin. Oh, over here. Here you go, Ewe, you see that buggy? That's what you get to. Some regular milk. That's some coffee stuff. Mocha, they just had the light, but that's fine. We've gotten that before. And then extra creamy whipped topping and sweet and creamy international delight creamer. Some vanilla yogurt. Vanilla or strawberry? Vanilla. vanilla. We can get some paper towels while we're down here on this end. They got it cold in here, don't they? About time for them to cut the heat on. <laughs> Let's get some paper plates. Or do we still have paper plates? Did we get a big one last time? I can't remember. Hmm. I may wait on paper plates. You do not? Would you rather have cream soda or the little sprites? Cream soda. I'll let you put that in the buggy while I get some Mellie Yellas Dr. Thunders. Do you mind getting a thing of Mellie Yellas? Get some more sausage and I'll make some more sausage biscuits for the freezer. I'm gonna go ahead and get some thawed chicken because I think I want to make chicken noodle soup tonight. 
that would make that easier. Yeah, you can get it. Can I see it? Is it got marshmallows? Okay, sure. Oh, look, they've got kettle corn and caramel apple too. I don't think you'd like those. Pumpkin spice. Special K, pumpkin spice Cheerios. Well, we ain't get none. I need oats. Get Justin a few more of these little cups to take to work. I wonder if he would like that. I didn't let him try it, I guess. Almost done. Can you put these in the buggy? Thank you. What do we got here, Wyatt? Yeah, you want one right now? Some blue fruit snacks? Okay. We're running for some bread. Saving a couple dollars and getting the great value chicken strips this week. I walked past the $11 top chick. Chicken fingers. They right, said so they wanted a green grapes this week. Oh, so then I guess you could scan this and it would tell you. Oh, so you can add it to your cart if you're doing scan and go. I think we're done. There's our buggy. Did I even show y'all that I got these? I don't think I did. It'll be an easy lunch or feed yourself not. job of showing y'all everything while we were in the store I was trying to think if there's anything that I didn't show you and the only thing I can think of is when we were in the freezer section Easton asked about getting a Salisbury steak freezer meal to have for lunch one day and so he got that I can't remember if I showed it but overall I think I did a pretty good job of showing everything y'all I forgot the one thing that I went to Walmart for the whole reason why I went to Walmart I was gonna get the nighttime grab water for Fletcher and I forgot. We even went to the baby stuff first so that I wouldn't forget. And I still forgot so I'll either have to go back tomorrow or maybe Justin can stop and get some. As far as meal plan this week, we're keeping it pretty simple. Doing meat and vegetables, we'll probably do meatloaf, hamburger steak. I did go ahead and get some chicken that was thawed so that I can do Shasta's chicken noodle soup. I'm going to try to get that. I think, I think I'm going to try to go ahead and put it in the crock pot and just put it on high. Because we're going to eat a little bit later dinner tonight anyway. I don't know. We'll see. But I think I'm going to go ahead and do that today. I didn't do spaghetti last week. We did the vegetable beef soup instead. So I'm going to do spaghetti this week. And then we'll have a takeout night. Which actually, it'll be... We're going to go out to eat for Papa's birthday. So that's what we'll be doing that night. And then a feed yourself night where everybody just finds their own thing. I mentioned earlier in the video that I've had some people ask about if I ever share our budget or what we spend on groceries as a family of seven. And I do share about it from time to time. 
Y'all, you just gotta figure out what works for your family. Right now, what's working for us is about $600 a month or about $150 a week, give or take a little bit. Now, as a family of seven, that's less than $100 a person per month, and that is for food and household items. So, paper towels, toilet paper, laundry detergent, all those kinds of things. Sometimes it's a little more, just depending, but that's where we try to stay. And I would love to just keep getting it lower. Now, that don't mean the grocery prices are going to go down. I think we all know that, you know, that'd be great. That'd be wonderful, but I don't think that's going to be happening anytime soon. I'm not, I'm not planning for that, but I want to just continue to grow more of our own food and put up more of our own food. Bless you. I don't know how some people spend a thousand dollars, twelve hundred dollars a month on groceries. We can't do that. We we have to make sure that we take care of growing a good bit of our own food and that really does help our grocery budget. That's where we're at right now. Like I said, I would love to keep getting that lower and lower. We'll see. We'll see. I'm, I'm gonna keep working on it. But you do what works for your family and for your budget and for what you like to feed your family. And that's what works for us. I have a dinosaur coming through the kitchen. Do you hear him? Y'all, it was a little different coming in and just putting all the groceries away. I don't know the last time I've done I usually always set everything out and, and show you. I think maybe the week right after I had Wyatt and the week right after I had Fletcher, I don't know that I did a grocery haul. Those two, like one week each time. But other than that, I do a grocery haul pretty much every week. There have been times where we've done two week hauls and so I'd skip a week, but yeah, as far as like actually bringing the groceries in and just putting them up, I was a little different. I enjoyed doing the video this way. We'll see what I think about it when I go to edit it, but it was fun to change it up a little bit this week. And y'all, with what I got today, talking about doing two week hauls, sometimes it's been a while since I've done that too, but with what I got today and what we already have in the house, I may not have to go to the grocery store next week. If I do, it'll be for, you know, milk, maybe some fresh fruit. So we'll see. We'll have to see how it goes. But just as I was putting things away and looking at what all we have, we may not have to go to the grocery store next week. My budget would like that. All right, y'all. I think I'll end this one here. Thank you for hanging out with me today. I love you. I appreciate you. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye, y'all. They said bye, too.